Let's make sure I could hear myself. Let's make sure I could hear myself. All right, all right, all right. It sounds beautiful on my end. It sounds beautiful on my phone. Uh, I'd like to welcome everybody back to the NASCAR Rivals Career Mode. Today we are starting the round of 16, the playoffs, whatever you want to call this monstrosity that they do in NASCAR anymore. The reality, we, we start the reality show of NASCAR. We are starting off the round of 16 today at Darlington. Uh, apparently I still need a tutorial on how to manage all these people that I have. Um, it, it's getting old at this point, motorsport games. Just take it off my screen. I re I, I know what I'm doing. Um, also, this too, I'm trying to save up for a Speedway car. It's just really getting old, motorsport games. Please just take this away. Calendar. Today we're going to Darlington in Kansas to kick off the round of 16. Next time we'll end the round of 16 and start the round of 12. Um... Yeah, we want, we're, we're currently seated 11th in the standings right now. I'm not expecting to get out of this round. I'm just expecting to stay above, uh, stay above these guys in 16th so we could get our way to RFK. Um, there's just, uh, our, our season's pretty much done at this point. There's really no hope in me making the next round. We don't have the car. We don't have the components. We don't have the rating components up to standards with everybody else. We're just looking to get... Pretty much looking to get this season done, pretty much, and get into a better car for next season. Um, but I guess uh, th without any further ado, we get we should get going uh, with Darlington. 92 laps around Darlington. I appreciate who's ever watching now, later, in the near future, or in the far future. I appreciate you watching this video, watching this whole series. Um, I would appreciate if you would hit the like and subscribe button for future content. Um, and without any further ado, let's get going. It's kind of sad that we're taking a super speedway car to a speedway. But um, hopefully, n not by the end of today's episode, but hopefully by maybe the end of tomorrow's episode, we could, um, we could um, have car three for a speedway. Because the road course car really doesn't matter right now. I guess that's my only goal before we leave this place is to is to uh, have a speedway car before we head off to a team, and we're gonna select our uh, super speedway car. Hopefully, we could uh, do what happened last time and uh, get the uh, get the fuel to lap down. Uh, ninety two laps for our first race in the playoffs round of sixteen. Again, I'm not expecting to get out of this round whatsoever. Uh, I'm happy with finishing in 16th in the point standings. So, uh, yeah, let's get this going at Darlington. And next race is Kansas after that. So, here we go. Welcome back to Darlington Raceway for the cookout. All right, we've heard enough of you already. Here we go, straight into qualifying. I don't think we qualified last year, last time we were here. So hopefully we could keep that up. And last time they weren't, they were actually kind of screwing up in the corners. So I don't know if that's still relevant. They've had a game update since that last time we've been here at uh, Darlington, so I don't know if they fixed it or what, but let's cross our fingers that they didn't. We're coming off turn four to grab the first lap and only lap of qualifying that we'll get.
Down the back stretch we go into turns three and four. Just looking not to start last here at Darlington. It's looking that way as we come off turn four down the front stretch. It is probably going to be last. Or not. 38. We'll take that. Ooh. Who got Paul? Kyle Bush looking strong. We're Chase Elliott on the front row with him. He's looking strong to start off the playoffs. Hopefully no DNFs. Um, now we're starting 36. We gained two more spots. Here we go to the race here at Darlington. I think it's the night one this the time. Ready. The team's already. All right. 36th place on the outside lane. Timmy Hill on our inside. And we are go, go, go. And we're in the wall already. Come on, Timmy. Give me a push, Greg Biffle. 28 laps this first stage. A pitch stop will need to happen. Come on, Timmy Hill. Seriously, dude. Look at that, man. Bunch of ridiculousness back here, man. I can't wait to get out of this place. This part of the freaking... There you go, douchebag. I'll happily pit. I'll happily fall to the back. Timmy Hill wants to race me like an idiot. I'll race him like an idiot. We're green here back at uh, Darlington. We couldn't even finish the first lap thanks to Timmy Hill. Twenty-four laps remaining left in the stage. I hope you have damage, Timmy Hill. I really hope you do. Still there. We're high, bud. Make up two spots on him and Biffle right there. Careful. Still there. Outside, outside. All clear. All Looks like I may still have a speed advantage uh, over these guys in the corners. And we run into the back of the 27. That one looking up top. Gonna get past him for 33rd. We're making up some spots here. Really liking that right now. Still there. Again, I'm not looking for anything too spectacular here. Not looking to get out of the round of 16, just looking to finish above 21st. And it is possible as Cody wears racing us like a complete moron. And Cody Ware spins us out. Can we get another caution? Track's all yours, but you're clear. Caution? Can we get a caution? How is this not a caution, Motorsport Games? Are you serious right now? Come on. That's idiotic. That is ridiculous what just happened. There was a two-car wreck and no caution was called. Well, at least if I wreck the field here, I should be able to stay on the lead lap. There it is. There's a caution. We'll pit again. I'll be happy to pit. 39th place it is. Cody Ware stuck a lap down. These back markers are just brutal. We're back under green. How many laps will we have to go? That's the question. 17 laps remaining. We should be able to make it to the end of the stage if there's no cautions. Come on. I don't know why I'm. I don't even know why I'm on the outside. As I put myself in the wall. There you go, Cody. Where? Just stay a lap down. 
We do have we do have the fuel to make it. I mean, I'm just gonna back off just a little bit in the turns. We are still faster than these guys in the turns for some weird reason. I get great exit speed compared to these guys. Thanks for the push, Timmy Hill. Ooh, but Ty Dillon, come on, man. Fifteen laps to go. We have enough fuel to make it. We just need pit stops to happen. They haven't pitted yet. We can maybe put them a lap down. They're still sliding up the track. Hopefully, maybe a stage win in our sight. That'd be a great way to start off the playoffs. I'm just honestly getting tired of when these when I'm in the back with these guys. All the all they're more worried about doing is wrecking me than actually racing. That's why I'm purposely putting them in the wall. I'm not trying to manipulate the game in any way. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Please do not call a caution for that. And there's a caution for that. Are you kidding me? Everybody's still not pitting. Even though that there's quite a good bit of the field pitting. Hmm. I'm not going to pit. Uh, I'm going to pit. Why not? Going to fall back to 36th again. Harrison Burton got himself loose off of two. And uh, he pretty much annihilated somebody back there. We're back under green. Ten laps to go in the stage. Some cars still haven't pitted. Harvick now leads us with ten to go in the stage. My attempt of trying to finish towards the front in stage one does not work. It could still work, as some cars still need to pit. They are just so slow going into that turn. Up to 29th, we'll take that. Car high here. Come on now. Got a car coming high right now. It's just a bunch of idiots on the track right now that don't know how to race. Careful, still there. All clear, nothing coming out back. Outside, all 30th place right now, I'm happy about this. Are you kidding me? What is everybody doing? Everybody is just brake checking each other going into this turn. Car outside, hold your line. What is that, motorsport game? You need to fix that. All the way to the wall. These people are pack racing up here. And he gets back underneath me. What in the world? Yellow, yellow, yellow. And there's another yellow. It's not my fault that Michael McDowell wants to F with me on the track every time he's around me. So that's why he's getting spun every time he tries to hit me. Back under green, five laps to go on the stage. I'm going to try to get down in front of Eric Jones because I need the inside line. And apparently we get the worst start in mankind history. But they should be, uh, I don't know, holding each other up here in about a second as Alex Bowman cycles out to the lead with five to go in the stage. Inside. Track's all yours, but you're all clear. Four laps to go in stage one. Bowman still leads with three laps to go in the stage. Looking outside now. All 
<laughs> there you go, Harrison. Twenty third place is the position that we're in right now. Bowman still leads, coming to two laps to go on the stage. Whoever that is on the outside looked like he was just clearly in the wall. Oh, here comes McDowell. It, he, what in the world? You see what he just does there and then he spins? He just looks like an idiot. A straight up idiot. Come on. Just getting absolutely dumped by all these people that don't like me on the track. It's just ridiculous at this point. On the last lap of the... Screw you, Todd Gillen. Seriously. Screw you and your whole freaking team. Bowman looks like he should win stage one. Bowman comes off turn four. He's going to get the stage one win. I'm going to dive bomb these guys. Screw them. There you go. 27. Gain two spots right there. I guess it's time to pit for all of us. Back to 31st we go. We had some damage. Starting stage two. Stage two is a go. Bowman still leads. Twenty-five laps is the distance here in stage two. Stay on the bottom right here. All right, you're clear right here. Ooh, a little bit slow out of two, Dylan. Three wide down the back stretch. Get a couple more passes done right there on Biffle and uh, JJ Yaley, it looked like. And we're up to 27th now. What is Chase Briscoe doing back here? Wasn't he up in the... Inside of Harrison Burton for 26. We have better cornering speed than everybody else does. Oh, I accidentally just tapped Briscoe. As he gets loose into turn one and the wall saves him. Oh, a little check up there by Harrison Burton. And we get loose off of two. Oh, come on now. There we go. There's another spot. Next up's LaJoy for 25th. Bowman still leads the stage. Oh, come on. Got to the quarter panel of LaJoy. Can't make the pass. Now going into three, he's going to scoot up just a little bit maybe as we hit him. Thank you, LaJoy, for 25th. Next is Suarez. Don't have the speed on the straightaway. I could sure use the help. And LaJoy doesn't mind pushing me up the track. That's nice. Briscoe now goes to my outside. Going to lose another position there. Can't let you go, Almirola. I have no idea what you're doing back here in the first place. Twelve laps of fuel left. Twenty laps to go on the stage. Should be able to make it on one stop. 
Oh, car turning on the back stretch. That's Ham when he's going back up the track. Two cars spun. Whoa. And there's a. Uh, we just put LaJoy in the wall. That's nice. Uh, we're going to take our pit stop here. Now we're all the way back to 39th place. Hamlin is out of the race in 40th. We are going back under green. We should have... Oh, my goodness. There's something wrong with Justin Haley. We can make it to the end of the stage, that's for sure. We're just waiting on pit stops. Hopefully, hopefully they pit this stage. They're going to have to anyway. We're up to 32nd, thanks to Justin Haley and his little mistake or error or whatever he has wrong with his car. Hoping for no caution here. We're hoping for pit cycles to go through. We were the only car that pitted, so we're looking for a stage win, maybe. 15 laps to go in stage two. We have 16 laps of fuel. We can make it as Denny Hamlin has DNF from this race. As Bowman still leads. We have a very good runoff turn two. We're going to make it three wide with J.J. Yaley and B.J. McLeod down the back stretch. I don't even know why I'm so, so worried about passing these guys. I know I'm faster than them on this track. I guess I'm just eager to get to the, to as much of the front as I can to get as much as the field a lap down as I can when they pit. About in the middle of the corner towards the end of the turn, they like slow up a lot to where I could get on the inside of them. Going on the inside of Timmy Hill for 26th. Glad to see we actually have some pace today here at Darlington. Those fresher tires are kicking in, it sounds like. We're actually making a gap on these guys behind us. Ah, uh, don't get greedy. Oh, I'm going to get greedy here. Side-by-side side with Corey LaJoy. Next is Daniel Suarez for 23rd. On the inside, a move on Daniel Suarez. 23rd is ours. We're looking good. No caution. That would be great. 12 laps to go in stage two. The stars are aligning for this stage. It's looking really good right now. Looking to put a good portion of the field a lap down to where the worst we could get is maybe a top 10. Not expecting a win, but if we do, that would be, that would shock some people. 12 laps of fuel left, 11 laps to go here in stage two. We can make it. Pit cycle should be happening soon. Really looking forward to that. Brad Keselowski now takes the lead from Alex Bowman. We just have straight up more pace than these guys today on fresher tires. Pit stop should be coming really soon, actually. Maybe with like six, seven laps to go, there should be pit stops. As we sit in 23rd, Eric Almirall looks like he's behind us as Brad Keselowski leads this race with nine laps to go in stage two. And I'm just begging for not a caution. That's all I'm begging for. Not a caution. Not a caution. If they pit this light towards the end of the stage, they're pro oh, there are some pit goers this time around. We'll have eight laps to go. 
This is a pretty long pit lane, so we should be able to put a good chunk of the field a lap down. We have made we have made some ground back on Kurt Busch. More cars are pitting this time around. Up into the top 20, maybe top 15 now. Cars are coming out of the pit. Seven laps to go in stage two. We do put Logano a lap down. That's a start. These guys still have to get up to speed and get back behind me. As Brad Keselowski, the leaders, are pitting. That car in front of you is coming to the pit. He better. There he goes. Kurt Busch peels off the track. Looks like most of the leaders peel off the track. We're going to get some spots here. Up into the top five we go. It looks like six laps to go in stage two. We can make it. Christopher Bell now pits. Everybody else should be pitting this lap. Who is that? Noah Gregson just peeling off. Christopher Bell peels off from the lead. We're coming down the front stretch. We now lead stage two. Five laps to go in stage two now. Brad Keselowski. Looks like we're going to get out ahead of him. We have him a lap down. Coming off turn four, we should be able to get past Christopher Bell and we have the whole field a lap down. It just depends if we can hold them off. We do get past Christopher Bell. Brad Keselowski's in second place behind me. He's a lap down. He does seem to have faster speed than me. We're most likely going to have to let him go. Unless we just do some amazing blocking. It's not going to happen, folks. <laughs> it's not going to happen. Oh, Keselowski, don't spin, dude. Three laps to go in stage two. Keselowski gets his lap back. I don't honestly know if these guys are going to pit or not. It's going to be interesting if they do. We do have a group of three cars now behind me. Jeez, Bowman. Bowman just sends it off in there. I understand that you're faster than me, but no need to punt me off the track. As both RFK cars are in the lead lap now. Both in the top five. Looking like a good day for RFK racing. Two laps to go in stage two. We still lead it. Keselowski's in second as we let the top five go through. As Alex Bowman's being held up by Kaz Grala. Go ahead, Chase. I'm giving it to you. We go into turns three and four. Oh, sorry, Chase. Come off turn four. We are on one to go, looking for another stage win. Ten points added to our name. As our plan does kind of work, as we are letting people back on the lead lap. We're going to get a push from Ricky Stenhouse Jr. down the back stretch. He does not like us, that's for sure. We're going to come off turn four. We're going to win the stage. Hopefully put Kaz Grala down another lap. We're going to finish in first place, but we only let the top five go through. And there's another stage win and ten points added to our name. It's going to be interesting who pits and who doesn't pit. They pitted with six, seven laps to go. I don't know if they're, I don't know if they're going to stay out or not. But stage win does go to us. Looks like everybody is pitting. Everybody through six looks like they got their lap back. 
and it looks like 36 through the end it looks like they're multiple laps down it's gonna be interesting what happens here we're gonna lose a spot to Brad Keselowski and it looks like only seven cars will be on the lead lap so maybe hoping that this race goes to the end till green we're back underway 59 out of 92 there will be there will be multiple pit stops Oh, are we going to get ahead of Brad Keselowski? Let's go. We got a good start right there. We're back ahead of the field. Probably not going to last for long. Looks like we have maybe 32 laps to go. So pit stops will be required this stage. All I can say is all we can do is try right now. I'm not going to say it's a win. As Brad Keselowski just has better exit speed than me. Looks like RFK going for a 1-2 right now. It looks like it might be possible if uh, Ricky Stenhouse doesn't put me in the wall. Clear and behind him. Inside, inside. Clear behind him. We are in fifth right now. Only seven cars on the lead lap. Thirty-one laps remaining. We did win stage two. As you can now see that uh, the drivers that are in the playoffs, you can see that they have a tag underneath their name, indicating that they are in the playoffs. Elliot's going to go for a move on the outside. I'm going to hold it on his inside. Put him in the wall just a little bit. Make the Elliot fan base pretty mad right there. We're going to get a push from Reddick, it looks like. 30 laps to go. Oh, come on, Reddick. The dude just holds on to the back of my car and drives me up into the wall. Oh, my gosh. Come on. All of a sudden, my car wants to get tight. I get just spun by Cindric. Absolutely disgusting. Seriously, come on. My whole race just got screwed over. We have arrow damage. I got purposely spun by Cindric. Um, I'm sure gonna need a caution. Still technically on the lead lap, but, um, yeah. Don't know what to say right now. This game wasn't wrong when it said, um, when they, when they stuck rivals on the game. Oh, shit. I'm not wrecking him. I wrecked these guys behind me, though. Why not? Who was that behind me in the bed MGM car? I don't know. Oh, shit. Can we get a caution? Maybe not. Don't know. My gosh. Can we get a caution? Motorsport games. Outside, outside. No caution is being called. What in the world, man? Motorsport games with their great game designing, am I right? Maybe that'll bring out a caution. My goodness. Finally. Drop all the way back to 35th thanks to Austin Shindrick, that dumbass. 
Alright, uh, he's gonna get it when I get back up to him. Somebody's got a problem in this huge pack. Because maybe the front 10 just took off. Still there. Clear all around. All clear. Car there on the outside. Got one down low. What in the world? There's a wreck. Yellow flag. We'll pit again, why not? Should be able to make it to the end of the race now, hopefully. Coming to 18 laps to go, I believe. Oh, somebody's got a problem. Come on, Ty. Still there. Got one on the outside now. Still there. Oh, hello, Cendric. I see you up there on the outside line. Looks like JJ Ailey wants to try to defend you here a little bit. Yeah, and then JJ Ailey just completely spins on his own and gets saved by the wall. Sounds about right. Oh, look at Cendric. You are so cute, dude. Still there. Yeah, let's turn this into a mess. There you go. You want to ruin my race? I'll completely ruin your race. Honestly, don't know how that didn't put you out of the race, but everybody should be able to make it to the end now. Thanks to me. Stay low. Kyle Bush leads with 14 laps to go. We go from being in seventh place to being put a lap down thanks to Austin Cendrick, but we did give him our payback. So I'm, a, I'm okay now. I gave him what he deserved. Yeah, screw you, BJ McLeod. Christopher Bell, what are you doing back here in nine? Oh, he probably got his lap back. I'd love to be in your position right now, Christopher Bell. I honestly would, but that car up there with the yellow stripes at the bottom of his car is who I have to thank. Twelve laps to go. We can make it to the end now. And there goes McDowell. Come on. Caution. No caution. Seriously. Oh, there's a caution. I'll just pit again. I swear, we just got a bunch of buffoons on the track. And I'm one of them. And we still have a whole other race to go. Why all of a sudden did I just get a terrible start during that restart? We are in 35th though. We do have our top 35 in hand. Still there. Yeah, come on Ryan Boyne. You see me down there, buddy. You just don't want to give up that line. Thanks for the push. 
Come on, Suarez. I like how they always just drive back up into me and I put Blaney in the wall. Highly deserved. Yeah, I'm gonna go underneath you, Suarez. Screw you. I ain't messing around. I'm trying to get some spots here, Suarez. You're just not moving. Oh, look at Justin Haley. You're cute. There you go, buddy. Oh, here's my here's my two favorite rivals, Cody Ware and Michael McDowell. Five laps to go in the race. Kyle Busch looks like he might be the first one to advance to the round of 12. Screw you, Cody Ware. Seriously. Oh, McDowell. I'm here, buddy. Looking for 29th position. On your inside, dude. I'm here. Oh, there's Biffle as well. Give me a push down the front stretch. I sure appreciate it. Four laps to go. Now Tyler Reddick leads. We got past Biffle for 28th. Looking for a move on Timmy Hill. He's slow out of two. So is Harrison Burton. Looking to get to his outs inside. Almost said outside there. Up to 26 now. A top 25 might be in the cards for today. As that is maybe the first time I can say that I have more genuine pace than that, those guys back there. I don't know if it's just because of the way that they designed this track to where they're so slow out of the corners. And there's another caution. Wow. We're going to have a two-lap shootout. And all the leaders are pitting. I might get the lead lap. No, never mind. All the leaders pitted, and we're coming to two to go. It says I'm restarting in 26th, but I'm on the inside lane. Oh, there's somebody in the back. That's why I'm back here. Two laps to go. Alex Bowman now takes the lead. Move it. There we go. Still there. Top 25 is definitely in the cards today. We're coming to the white flag. I'm a lap down. Stay on the bottom. Get past Almirola. Get past Cindric. We're up to 24th. Outside by That's your One lap to go. Bowman leads it. Come on, Jones, go up the track just a little bit. There you go. Let off that gas. Side by side with Eric Jones down the back stretch. We're going for 23rd place on him. Maybe getting the move done on Kurt Busch here for 22nd. Oh, he's pushing me down big time. 21st side by side with Corey LeJoy to the line. We're going to get 21st. We'll definitely take that. I sure will. 95 speed rating. I sure want to see where uh, where I flipped Harrison Burton because that looks pretty nice. Bowman wins stage one. Make a pass for first place. I win stage two. I made a nice pass on the outside. Oh, there's me wrecking the field. Me and Timmy Hill get into it. What happened? Oh, yeah. I purposely went back up the track to take out somebody. Oh, there goes Michael McDowell. All right. That's going to end race one of this episode. It looks like Kyle Larson actually ends up winning this race from Bowman.
Kyle Busch, Keselowski, Reddick, Bell, Busher, Martin Truex Jr., Elliott, and Ryan Blaney rounds out your top 10. Um, we finish in 21st. I guess that's all right. We'll take that. Looks like we almost got 250 grand in that race. We now move up to 7 in points, actually. Wow. We might make it out of the round of 16. That actually might be pretty cool, then. Thank you, Alex, for the comments. <laughs> wow. Go wreck the two. Yeah, the two certainly ruined my race. That's for sure. I gained 33,000 more fans that race. That merchandise money keeps going up. All right, now who's ready to just see me ride around the track here at Kansas? Ooh, 40, oh, 47,000 more dollars coming in. Wow. Some encouraging words from Noah Gregson, it looks like. Wow, I'll give you a compliment. Wow, the guy that just ruined my race is giving me some wise words. Should I insult him or compliment him? Let me think about that for a minute. Ah, uh, nah, we're here to be the nice guy. As long as you don't race me like a douchebag on the track again, Austin Cendrick. You did ruin my race. All right. This next race should be nice and boring. With a chance of maybe, maybe of us getting out of the round of 16, 67 laps at Kansas Speedway. We're taking another super speedway car there. Are you kidding me? I can't wait. Who is this guy? Jake Wiggins, dude. You look like a stud, man. We might, we might have to give you a promotion. You look like a stud. All right, taking, uh, I'm ready to ride in the back again here at Kansas. Not have the speed as everybody else does. Here we go. I'm Alex Hayden, and we're here in Kansas for the second race of the round of 16. These drivers... Okay, we've heard enough from you today already. All right. Let's hopefully not qualify in last, even though that we are probably going to be in last for most of the race. Pretty much just looking to get this race done. Hopefully fall back under the cut line. Oh, almost hit the wall there. Oh my. <laughs> we have no speed whatsoever. Okay, fast lap here. All right, fast lap here, my spotter just said. Doesn't this spotter know that we committed career suicide when we wanted to start our own team off in the first season?
we come off turn 4, 31, 32, 33, it's a 33 8. Not last. Probably will be last by the end of lap 1, but this is going to be great. Kaz Grala and uh, Loris, the 27 car, had a worse lap than us. Don't know how. It's a miracle. We are not starting last. Goal position at 35th. I'm expecting to go a lap down before the end of the first stage. But hey, if these guys want to put me in the wall, start off the race, these guys are going to get it. Oh, and here's the perfect candidate for that. J.J. Yaley. Put me in the wall before we even get to the green flag. See what happens. Oh, you're already trying it? There you go. Nineteen laps here in the first stage. So happy you want to turn your car more to the right than you do the left. We're underway at Kansas. Kyle Busch leads once again in this episode. As he's holding that high line pretty well. How can that be? And when I when I thought I believed Blaney started on the front row. Either Blaney had a pretty bad start up there. Or... Hold your line, got one inside. you got room, you're all clear. Well, Kaz Growl is looking to dive it in on me. I'm going to let him have it. Let's see if he puts me in the wall. Nope. Wow. That's interesting. I'm actually surprised that I'm sticking with these guys back here for now. Let's give it another lap or two. We'll be running by ourselves. I'd honestly believe I, if I just had a speedway car, I'd, I'd be better than this group of guys all the way up there to Timmy Hill. Can't you just pit already, J.J. Ailey? Oh, hello, Loris. I see, I see you still don't like me by bumping me. All right, 39th place it is. So far, a clean race so far from, not just from our side, but from our rivals that don't like us. Besides J.J. Yaley wanting to put me in the wall before we even got to the green flag. That's always nice. So every time that happens, it's an automatic spin in my book. Fourteen laps remaining here in stage one. Kyle Busch still leads. We're in 39th, second to last. Is JJ Ailey's uh, hunting us back down after we spun him? Now Blaney takes the lead. He's back up to the lead. Nice. There will have to be pit stops made this stage. And there's a caution. Is everybody pitting? Not everybody's pitting. Wow, we could get a top 10 this stage. We move back to 39th. Looks like Christopher Bill, Chase Briscoe, Harrison Burton, Kaz Grala are all the ones that pitted. Kaz Grala actually making a pretty smart decision right there to get some stage points. Looks like Denny Hamlin pitted too. Um... I believe what I'm just going to do is maybe just back off of this and take my top 10 in this stage. Maybe put the field lap down, whoever's in the lead. That'd be nice. Or whoever will cycle out into the lead. 
I'm always happy to take a free pit stop when we can all when we can always make it to the end. And maybe some stage points to Oh no. And we're in the wall. Thanks, Harrison Burton. Why are you guys checking out out of turn four? What is going on back here? Just an absolute monstrosity is going on back here. That's what's going on. I'm happy to sit here and last though. As long as as long as whoever cycles out laps laps everybody on the pit line, we should be fine. Because only one car is going to get their lap back at a time. We should be seeing pit stops very soon. Maybe with five to go, four to go. And whoever cycles out into the lead, they're, they're going to have to get past them to get their lap back. Because because uh, that's what you got to do. We should be able to keep our lap. We have no I have no idea what Denny Hamlin's doing back here still. He's just sitting behind Kaz Grawl when he can easily go past him. I was content sitting behind everybody. I was content sitting in that pack up there where they were, but uh everybody checked up and I went to the outside and I put myself in the wall. I have no idea why they're checking up. But all we're hoping for is not a caution for the end of the stage. Because they will have to pit. Six laps to go in stage one. Boiney still leads with hopefully still pit stops to come. They shouldn't be able to make it. Unless Motorsport Games just gave them an absolute like prayer and they're not gonna make they're gonna make it. So hopefully maybe pit stops maybe within the next two laps or so. Just hoping not for a caution. Because if that's the case then this all went the doo doo. I'm always happy to pit under a caution when I'm in my fuel window. Five, to go at the line. Five laps to go on the stage. Boiney on the back stretch. We should be getting pit stops very soon. As Hamlin is still sitting out there on the outside in this backpack. What is he doing? This dude could easily be ahead of that pack. I know I sure would. Should be seeing pit stops here very soon within the next lap or so. It should just be... And I don't know. I don't know if these guys will pit if they're pitting this light towards the end of a stage. Four laps to go on this stage. Pit stop should be happening. I don't know why they're not... Oh, here we go. Pit stops are happening now. Eric Jones takes the lead. A good chunk in the field hits. And I don't know if they're going to pit again. Uh, at when we get to the end of the stage, there's more cars pitting. We're up to 35th. Three laps to go on the stage. I don't know if they're taking four tires, two tires, or just gas. But we're hoping for a top 10 this stage. We're up to 25th. Just got to play the fuel game. Happy to play it. Hamlin should cycle out in the lead. I'm hoping Hamlin can get in front of the Sweet. Thank goodness. If Hamlin can stay in front of those cars, that'd be great. Or whoever's in the lead up there. Because we, we got the fuel trapped a lap down if that's the case. It doesn't matter if I pass him or not, but... We're up to sixth position in the stage now. We should be coming to one to go. Push me, Byron. There you go. Briscoe's not pitting. Are you kidding me? Oh, he must. He must be the. He must be the car that pitted during that caution. We do have the field to lap down if Briscoe stays out front. Here we go now. Three 
Or if we maybe do that. Maybe not. I saved you, Byron. I saved you. Oh, what a push. Another push. These guys love me. Looks like Briscoe's going to win the stage. We're going to bring it home in six. We're definitely going to take those points. Oh, I'm loose. What the heck just happened? I'll definitely take that. Sixth place in stage one. Let's go. Ooh, it looks like only Larson's going to get his lap back. We're going to be in seventh place. Oh, more cars got the wave around. Kaz Growl is up here. Let's go. Be smooth out here. Let's have a good day. Be ready here. Here we go. We're back under green. Looks like I'm, I don't know who got their lap back. I don't think everybody behind us pitted towards the end of that stage. Give me that push, Larson. Why don't I get a tag above my car that Clear. indicates that I'm in the playoffs? Outside. I honestly don't know how many cars are on the lead lap at this point. I saw a whole bunch of them got a wave around. We are so slow on the straights. Got a car coming high now. What in the world? It is just monstrosity, people trying to get past me. They just use my car as a battery ram. Come on now. Here we go. There goes the joy. Oh, <laughs> come on. That's got to be a caution, right? No cautions called, okay. Whatever Motorsport Games thinks, I guess. It's just lolly land with them. We're in 18th place, though. 19th now. How many cars are on the lead lap? Did everybody seriously get... Did everybody seriously not pit at the end of that stage? I guess not. 15 laps to go. Thanks, Truex. We're using my car as a battery ram. Back to 21st now. There's one car in pit lane. Don't know who that is. Is that Cody Ware chasing me now? Okay. I invite you, Cody, to hit me. There you go. That's always nice. And the next part's always nice when you run me up the track. Here comes another rival of mine, Kurt Busch. My gosh. Okay, Kurt. I'm literally just full gassing the car around the track. That's how bad our car is at this. <laughs> That's what I get when I don't bring the right, the right car to the track. Let alone to say that we don't even have the money to buy the car yet. So yeah, happy times, happy times. We fall back to 25th now. I guess it's not the end of the world. We just have no. We we have no. We have no speed. Oh, I'm getting loose. Get way loose. These guys should have to pit before us, shouldn't they? Got one rolling on your inside now. Oh, here he comes. McDowell. What in the world, dude? There you go. You want to push me down underneath the track? Screw you.
Hopefully I just gave you engine damage. Happy to use your car as a battery ram every time. These guys are just passing me on the outside like I'm nothing. Got one coming hard up top. Outside. Oh, here's our other good friend, Austin Sendrick. Oh, there's a car pitting. Who's that? That's Byron. So those those guys those guys that didn't pit towards the end of the stage might have to be pitting here soon. Look how slow we are. It's not even funny. So I guess everybody got their lap back for not pitting at the end of the stage, which, okay, I guess I see that. They did pit really close towards the end of that stage to where they probably didn't have to pit during the stage break, and they all got their lap back. I mean, I could have been a... Con Total, I could have been a total jackass and stayed out on the track on purpose so nobody got their lap back and I could have just purposely wrecked the field and we could have been playing one by one. Ah, oh, here we go, JJ Yaley. You know what? There you go. You like that, JJ? You like that? There you go. I will clearly make time for you every time on the track to wreck you. Hey, we're in 35th. Here he comes again towards the bottom of the track. How are me and you repairing a, a track relationship when you just want to do that to me every time? Is there even a way that we could repair our track relationship? I don't think there is. Once they just start ha hating you, there's like... I, I, I guess I guess you gotta go up to a better team to prove to them, oh, I'm better than you. Four laps to go in stage two. We're in 35th. Blaney still leads the way. Yaley's still worried about putting me underneath the track as Harvick is too. Where am I supposed to go, Harvick? I can't go anywhere. You're the one driving left into my car. Three laps to go in stage two. So happy to be that I could be the benefit for you, JJ Alien, getting a free pit stop towards the end of this stage. There is a car out. I don't know who that is. Two laps to go on the stage. Boiny leads. We did get some points in stage one. Happy for that. I think the end out I think to end out the um, round of 16 we go to Bristol tomorrow and we do have a short track car not gonna say that we're gonna be the best but I hope when we go back to Bristol dirt next season that it's still all messed up as there's one lap to go on stage two Ryan Boyney still leads we're back here in 36 one place away from 35th As the leaders go into turn three and turn four now. Blaney looks like he's going to come off four and take stage two. As Briscoe took stage one. And yep, Blaney takes stage two. We're going to get 36. Looks like everybody's pitting. 
We have 27 laps remaining. We're going to pit two. Harvick gets the free pass. He's back on the lead lap. As we are back here in 36th, next to BJ McLeod. And I invite him to run me up the track. I honestly do. Yep, here he goes. Look at this! Still there. Got one peeking inside. Very low, bud. Wow, dude. Dirty motherfucker. Wow. And I can't get back to him. Still there. Oh, LaJoy, you want some of this too, dude? There you go. Look ahead for me here. Clear out Have fun. Hopefully you got engine damage. Outside. Damn, Harvick. You get up to the front, dude. Looks like your car just shot out of a cannon. Oh, look who's in the lead. Bubba Wallace. He won this race in real life in the fall, too. Might be cool to see him win a race. Coming up to 22 laps to go. Who is that behind me? Michael McDowell? So happy to see you here, Michael McDowell. It's so nice to see you, buddy. Focus forward here. And he... What in the world? Come on. That's always nice to see, ain't it? This may just me be they. You know what? This, this this is me just being a complete idiot. You're gonna like what's gonna happen when when they come back around. This is just me getting completely desperate. They gotta get here first. They're going pretty slow. Bubba Wallace takes the lead back. Maybe this is why I am a jackass on the track. That's all right though. We're going slow for a reason. You'll see why. You'll see why. Who is that racing for the lead? Oh my gosh. Car high here. Careful. Looking forward here. Clear outside. Got a car coming high now. Clear out back. Got one outside now. Got a nose in there. To your door. There it is. We'll get our we'll get our lap back. We got our free pass. We got a free pit stop. We should be able to make it to the end of the race now. Starter's got the flag in hand. Right. We'll definitely take Go that. Green. Fifteen laps of fuel. We should be able to make it to the end of the race. Hopefully. Ooh, it's going to be close. Still there. It's going to be close. All clear. Nothing coming out back. Everybody still hasn't pitted. It's going to be very close on fuel. Far outside, hold your line. Clear all around. If I can stay in this draft just a little longer. Got one on the inside. McDowell, dude. I'm about tired of it. Go ahead, have that spot.
happy to sit by behind you guys. Happy to sit here in this draft and save fuel. Still there. Got back under McDowell, surprisingly. Okay, dude. You're this is just getting old the motorsport games. Seriously. I'll just keep sitting behind him. I'm happy to be here. These guys still have to pit. I can I can stay out on track. Oh my gosh, Timmy Hill just annihilated me. Eleven laps to go. I still have their draft. This went down to ten laps. Hopefully that can make us lose in the turn three lose gas going into turn three I'm happy to sit here in this draft I really am ten laps it depends where we go down to nine at I can definitely still save some gas here. This draft is helping me save some gas. Nine laps to go. Still sitting here in BJ McLeod's draft. Us losing a lap out of two, it looks like. A lot of people are pitting right now. We're coming to eight laps to go in the race. Boy, and he still leads it. Losing our lap of fuel coming out of the turn. It's going to be close. Everybody else pits. Who stays out? It looks like JJ Yaley does. Okay, we we have we have our we have us losing our lap of fuel coming out of two. Oh, JJ Yaley is slow. Clear high behind this one. Got a gap up top. He ran out of gas. There's something wrong with Reddick too. Got one up top. We're coming to six laps to go. We're in first place. Could we possibly do this? These guys have a long way around the track to go to catch me. Now we're losing our lap of fuel coming out of the turn. It is going to be close, folks. And there's a caution. Are you kidding me? Jeez. Well, I should be able to make it now if I don't pit. I gotta take a gamble here. Be out here. It should be three laps to go, two laps to go. Green, green, green. We're back under green. Three laps to go, five laps of fuel. We can make it. Right, I got a gap. Clear up top here. 
We have the lead. We're pulling away just a little bit. Not going to last for long. Oh, give me a push. Give me a push. Please give me a push. Oh my gosh. We're actually holding it. What is going on here? Oh, here they come. Outside. Two laps to go. We're still in the lead. Bowman just flies on by. I have no idea what to say right now. This could go very bad. I had to try something. I could have took my free pit stop. I had to at least try something, folks. It's better to try something than nothing. Oh, Almirola pushing me up the track. The question is, how far are we going to drop back? That is the question. Oh, can't be that far back if Stenhouse is passing me for 21st. A top 20, maybe? JJ Yaley, do you not realize that you're putting another car in the wall when you do that? Clearly not. A top 20 looks like it's in the the picture as we're on the last lap. We come up the final corner. Harvick looks like he's going to win this race. We're going to come up the final corner and get a 17th place finish as Blaney just got a rocket ship of a... Wow! Blaney on the top side got one heck of a absolute shot out of a cannon. And I don't even know if that was for position or not. Wow. Oh, what is this? Hamlin and Ricky Stenhouse make contact. Oh, Hamlin on the straight just spins. Uh, we're going to get Denny Hamlin in a thumbnail right there. There you go, Hamlin. Oh, boy. There's Hamlin. Okay, that's good enough for me. Anybody but me in the thumbnail. That'd be great. Um, We're going to go back. We finished in 17th. Not last. Always happy not to finish in last. Ooh, it was going to go back all the way. The, the worst position we could have got was 20th. And I'll take that every day. I'll take that any day. I was hoping for no caution because I think we could have won that race, to be completely honest with you. We finish in 17th. Harvick wins from... Kyle Busch, Alex Bowman, Eric Jones, Chris Buescher, Bubba Wallace, Brad Keselowski, Chastain, Denny Hamlin, and Eric Almirola finish out your top 10. There we are in 17th. What do the playoff standings look like? Did we did we miss them? Or I, or I just completely ignored it? We got 300,000 from today's race. There we are. Eighth place. We're looking, we're looking pretty good to get into the round of 12. We are looking good. Hamlin, Kurt Busch, Chase Briscoe, William Byron are, are all under the cut line. We're 17 points to the good. Wow. Kyle Larson is already advancing. I thought Harvick was in the playoffs, but I guess not. As uh, Harvick won that race. Always nice to see a different winner. Got 308,000 from that race. I'll definitely take that. Definitely after Bristol, we should have a Speedway car ready to go. We're at 2.6. Timmy Hill, this is about the fifth time you sent me this message this season. And me, me apologizing to you does absolutely nothing, so... I don't even know what the point of responding to you is. All right. Looks like uh, next race will be Bristol Motor Speedway. Um, 125 laps around there. Maybe an advance, ad advance to the next round. Don't know. There we are, eighth in points right now. We are looking good. We are looking good. 
And if we and if that could happen, wow, that might open up another opportunity to another team. Don't honestly know to who, but it might. Um, Harvick won that race. We finished twenty first and seventeenth in those races. Um, if we go look at our departments, we're still at 80, 75, 90, 90 on the pit crew, which I guess is okay. Uh, if we were to bump them all the way up, it'd be two, three, four, uh, 2.3 mil. I, I don't honestly want to be doing that right now. Our, our main goal is to try to get this speedway car to where maybe we could have, I don't know, some, some type of chance of staying with these guys on the track, but. I'm not going to complain where we are in the standings right now. It's it's clearly exceeding my expectations. Again, if we do end up falling underneath that cut line of uh, out of the top 16, I'm completely fine with that as long as we stay, above, stay 16th or above in the points afterwards. But, um, yeah, next uh, episode should be Bristol and Texas, I believe. Yep. Uh, Echo Park Automotive 500 at Texas Motor Speedway should be our next right. Uh and Bristol should be our next two races. Then we go. Then we go Super Speedway racing, where it takes all the skill you need at Talladega. So yeah, that should be that should be pretty interesting. We are closing in on a million fans too, so those merch payouts should be kind of helping us a lot here. Um, I appreciate you guys uh, watching this. I appreciate you guys watching this series. Um, I appreciate the support. I would uh appreciate if you would hit the like and subscribe button if you liked what you see. Uh, I appreciate you watching now, later, in the near future, or far future. And uh, this has been Career Mode, episode number 14, stream 14, whatever you want to call it at this point. Um, yeah, this has been Zach the Gamer on NASCAR Rivals Career Mode, signing out. Peace out.